Hello, and welcome to Beast456 on the Milky Way. We're here again in my uh, Volts world. So, uh, my centrifuge has been very busy, and um, so have I, actually. I've added some bronze ingots to here, and uh, I've done quite a lot of making some bronze, because uh, you need it a lot. I finished the reactor, got it all set up, and I wanted to show you guys a few things before I really got it started running. So, um, I also collected a ton of wool because <laughs> you need a lot of it, but okay. So here, I'll show you guys to the basement where we've got our reactor all set up. Yeah, there it is. And these are turbines, reactor turbines. Oh, bit buggy there. Um, now this here is a thermometer, and that is made by Thermom. That is steel around a thermal meter, which is made with basic circuits, and steel and glass. Now this is uh, that Warren 1000. The zero is what the temperature is. Warren 1000, when that zero hits 1000, it sends a redstone impulse, which then is connected to, down here, this piston, which has a control rod on it, which shoots up and stops the reactor, which is right here. So this here is our sort of, I guess, our manual, how we put um, uranium into the reactor, and it's our, also our manual shut off in case the thermometer does not work, because we definitely need one of them. So uh, what I've done is you need to fill up this area here with water, and a 3x3 three three area is best idea um, for the reactor, because what's going to happen is when you put uranium in, it's going to heat the water, boil it, and turn all these turbines. Now what you can do is you can take a wrench, and if you have nine like this, you can click it. Uh, you have to like yeah, click the center one. It makes a massive turbine like that. Now I've got some insulated high voltage wire here, and I'm going to run this up to a uh, battery box um, up here. So I'm going to dig up above. Ooh put that down Oop. Not like that uh, I want it just to go straight up and of course copper uh, yeah straight up yeah there we go you can see that so I'll go ahead and cover back up this hole and we'll run that line down or up I mean not down <laughs> into our uh, house so we can get some electricity Ah, right here. Yep. Now, ooh, I'm hoping I can. Yeah, I can nerd pull. Okay, good. Um, that's a very awkward place to have this. Actually, uh, I need it going to a battery box. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually dig the floor out a bit. I'm going to have battery box over here. Yeah, I'll have battery boxes over here that then connect up to everything. I still have my battery box that's connected to the uh, solar panels, or advanced solar panels, rather, outside. And I'll have it connect, like, right here into a few battery boxes. I'll have, like, two stacked up, so I collect a ton of energy. And whenever I get my uh, fusion reactor set up, then that will be pretty good. Now... I'll show you guys in a minute how to uh, change the settings on the thermometer. So just let me. Eh, eh. There we go. All right, let's cover this up. Uh, I definitely need to make this base a lot neater. It's just like a pile of cobblestone. Damn it! It's just like it's just like a pile of cobblestone, pretty much. I'm gonna like change the walls into something that looks nice instead of just this crap. Because look at this. This is a mess. We got dirt there. This is not a place, not a place for humans. All right, let's see here. We need. How do you make a bat box? Forget. Battery box. Uh, should we go advanced? We'll just go regular for now. Okay, three batteries and three steel. Battery is tin, redstone, coal. Simple enough. How much tin we got? Uh, tin, tin, tin. Oh, there we go. We we'll get a stack of that because we need. Um, we need also. Redstone and ooh, a bit of lag spike there. Uh, coal, oh, tons of coal. There we go. 
Alright, um, tin, 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 tin. We need six. So I'll do that. Then we'll get six batteries. Okay, good. And then we need steel. So I'll go ahead and put that stuff back because if you click it, it drops everything into it. Put that back. Steel. Uh, stack of steel. Battery. 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 Steel, 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 steel. What? Um. How do you get those bars? Oh, you have to hold them. Well, that's annoying. That is that's stupid. Alright, I'll just go through and hold them all. <laughs> you gotta hold your batteries to make them, uh, okay. That's weird. Whatever. Alright, one battery box, and... I wish these batteries stacked, but of course they kind of can't, really. Um, two battery boxes, good. Now, which way is it? Red. Red is input, so that's wrong, obviously. We need to just switch it around. Alright, great. Now, obviously, we can... Uh, that should accept it. I think that'll be fine. We'll connect that up to our power grid, I guess you might call it. And that should be good. I'm not making any power up there. Why? Is it raining? No, it's just getting dark. Of course. I'll go to sleep real quick. And then we'll get this reactor started. Now what I did make is some hazmat armor because I've made some uranium and it hurts like a motherfucker if you do not. <laughs> Now I think the 238, look at this, it like eats your, your hazmat suit completely. It is obnoxious, but um, okay. Now I don't know what goes, I think it's uranium 238 that goes into the reactors. So why is it not making, oh, see I hate that, it like, eats all the power. I don't understand that at all. But it literally eats all the power that you get when like one or two machines are running. It doesn't even require that much. It just eats it all. Ugh. Whatever. Alright. Yeah. Let's get this started. Uh, we'll take uranium-238. Ugh. Quick. Quick. Before our hazmat, uh, has, bleh, bleh, hazmat suit dies. Go this way. Stick it in. Ah, oh, wrong uranium. Crap. Oh, that's not good. Oh, wait. Do you need to make certain... Do you need to make something special with uranium in order to get this to work? Oh, that might be... Oof. Or maybe it's enriched uranium. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'll try uranium-235. Let's go. I really do. Oh, crap. That's not good. Oh, shoot. That's really not good. Oh, what? Oh, what? I thought that was it. Hold on. Maybe there's something you need to make with uranium. That could be... That could very well be, and that is a bit annoying. Wait, what? I thought I just broke it. Oh, that's confusing. Whatever. Uranium. Um. I don't know. I thought that was it. Like. There's. Uranium, but what do you do with that uranium now? <laughs> Maybe it goes in the top? That could be. Um, though I don't see why it would. Uh, well, 
well now I need to figure out a way to get access to the top maybe you do have to stick it through the top but th that seems rather stupid can I even like click that from <laughs> no how am I supposed to do that this, this is annoying um maybe clicking it in the side will work just as well perhaps maybe I'll lower this so I can get to it uh where should it be like right about there no oh I'm so confused I have to make this a quick transaction. Oh, block it! Oh no! Dang it! That was what I was afraid of happening. Oh, that's annoying. Now I have to go back down here and replace all that. Oh, that's fine. There you go. All right. Let's just put that back. Alright, maybe, maybe we have to stick it, like, right here. Now, I don't like that too much, because now we're not making as much power, unfortunately. But whatever. That's fine. It'll have to do. I'll have to test this now. I hope, I'm hoping this works, because if it doesn't, then I'm not sure... I know one of them goes to a nuclear bomb, so we'll see. Uh, nuke, nuke, nuclear, enriched uranium. So it must be breeding uranium that we use in the reactor. Ooh, go, go, go. Oh dear. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh, come on. Are you serious? Maybe there's. Ah, oh, that sucks. That really sucks. Um. Well, crap. I'll have to look in that. That's... Oh, wow, that's... That baffles me. I seriously don't know. What's with this hazmat suit? It keeps, like, regenerating itself. I don't get it. Oh, so many things confusing me. Um... Hmm. Yeah, I'll have to research that, but that... Uh, that's annoying. Alright, well, since we can't do that right now, we'll have to wait till next time to power that up. Fortunately, yet again, um, I'll actually just because um, it automatically just goes on its own. I'll stop that for now because uh, don't actually want that running. Want to save up a bit of uh, power? Yeah. All right. And there's a reason why because I want to get the power suit power armor now we need this power armor tinker table which requires lapis blocks emerald and steel plates lapis um we need four there we go four an emerald and then four steel plates there we go then we can make our thinker table alright now with the power armor tinker table take this over um, place that here and we can click on that and get some power armor now in case you guys didn't notice uh, I did cut there and I figured out that it's actually a fissile fuel rod you need for the uh, reactor so we'll quickly make one of those and what would that require? uranium 235? yeah and we'll make that work real quick where's our... oh wait there they are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and then one, two, three. Quickly now. This little fuel rod goes like this. 
There we go. Now let's take this down and put this in our reactor real quick. And then we'll get into the power armor. Let's hope this works. Now I'm thinking that uh, I can actually replace this now. Oh wait. Yeah, that can go there. And that, that. And then I can actually just mine that out. Whoop. Oh gosh, again. <laughs> oh, I covered that. That's not good. Well, I guess I was good for that situation. Uh, this is actually. Uh, I'm just like, yeah. Okay, let's stick it in. Yes, yes, it should be working now. It went in. That's great. Let's quickly cover this up. Yep. Look at that. The degrees is going up. Great. Fantastic. Now it should start turning these soon. Um I think. Oh, yeah, I hear it. I rather did hear it. Uh maybe that's just the sound of the reactor. Do you guys hear that? I hear something. Let's go down here real quick and see what the temperature is. It's almost, wow, it's almost up to a thousand already. Maybe I'll have to raise that temperature then. Doesn't seem to be making any electricity right now. Maybe it is. Maybe it's just not showing it turning. Let's go up here and check, actually. Let's see. Oh, I heard that go off. Oh, yeah, it actually is making electricity. Oh, cool. Didn't make much, just a few kilojoules. Did make a little bit. Now that should have shut off the reactor. I'm hoping it did. Yeah. Uh, it's still increasing slightly. That's concerning. Should have shut it off. Uh, why is it still going up? Oh dear. This does not seem good. Um, uh oh. <laughs> uh, I heard it go up. Um, is it still producing electricity? It is not. Okay, we'll hope that's off. And we'll hope it does, does not blow up. Now, let's go ahead and make our power armor then. So we'll make the power tool first. That requires three basic circuits and some steel. Uh, three basic circuits are uh, steel plates, redstone. Okay, easy enough. Get a stack of that. Oops, not that much. Just a stack and a stack of steel. Uh, we'll make a. St Actually, we'll make like eight. There we go. And oh, what's a basic circuit again? Okay, and we need copper. Stack of that. Whoop. Bit of lag. Get out some. Ooh, a lot of wool. Should be good for now. Make just ten. There we go. Oh, I need a bit more wool for this job. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, shoot. Holy crap. Um, did I get the reactor back? Could I? Oh, gosh. That went awful. Oh, gosh. That went horribly. Shoot. Well, that couldn't have gone any better. Wow. Um, shit. <laughs> wow, I love how I just had it on for not even like five minutes now, and boom, I couldn't retrieve it.
Wow, that sucked. I'm glad it didn't damage these. Those were expensive enough. Well, <laughs> that really sucked. <laughs> Well, yeah, that that was awful. Okay, let's just make this power armor. You know what? Screw it. I don't even care. I'll get. I'll clean that up later. That. <laughs> That's disappointing. I don't even know what to say to that. <laughs> That was stupid of me to leave that just like that, you know, whatever. You know, temperature's increasing. Let's just leave it like that. Why not? <laughs> oh, why? Okay. <laughs> Do three. Right, wow. Okay. Here we go. All right, power tool, fantastic. Look at this bad boy. Now let's now let's see what we can do with this. Let's see if we can get a plasma cannon. Require some HV capacitors and force field emitters. That's not needed. <laughs> uh, shovel requires three iron ingots and a solenoid. Uh, it's probably the same. Yeah, it's the same for all of them. Uh, what's a solenoid? Let's make three of them. Soul. Oh, that's easy. Iron wiring. Oh, that's really easy. Yeah. We can make that easily. So, copper and gold. Let's go ahead and make that real quick. Oops. There we go. Uh, we need iron. I believe it was... No, it wasn't. Uh, duh. Wiring was like this. 1, 2, 12. 